and a warm welcome to our audience watching online from around the world. I'm your host today, Betty Chen. Welcome to the Kaohsiung Food Show and Kaohsiung Harika. From October 24th to 27th, here we are at Kaohsiung Exhibition Hall. This is the largest and the most international food show in southern Taiwan. The theme of this year's food show is Savor the Essence of October. You can find a high quality agri and seafood delicacies and savor the supply chain. Without further ado, I'm going to take you to five vendors today. So follow me this way. Let's go. Here we are at the first vendor, Mingda Foods. And joining me will be Elsa. Welcome. Thank you. Thanks for having us, Elsa. So could you please tell us a bit more about Mingda Foods, this brand? Uh, Mingda Food is founded in 1950 and it's over 70 years old right now. And it's now managed by the third generation. And we have over 50 products mm -hmm. and selling over 10 countries or overseas right now. Excellent. What's the competitive edge of Mingdo Foods? Uh, we have a clean level like this gift box. Oh, excellent. Uh, each of it have a double clean level. And we also meet US standards and passing HACCP and ISO 22 certifications to the early flavors and to the modern easy to use like this can be quickly used for dipping, mixing or stir frying various dishes. So I understand you have some more traditional products like the very famous a bean paste where you need to cook them. But for these new products, this is also the highlight, right? Yes, yeah, the, the highlight of products. So for example, you have a bowl of noodles or rice. You can just put them on top of the food and you can eat it right away right without away. further cooking, right? Yeah. yeah, so this is a star product. Tell us a bit more about that. We have the chili pepper with garlic and also and the black pepper beans. black beans yeah looks really really good <laughs> and all these are the important products right yes so yeah all right, let's have a look like the oil tofu goes very well with kanji right and also this is the star product definitely right tell us a bit more about this chili bean paste on um, it's traditional fermentation techniques by sun drying in a large ceramic get clay jars and our sun drying yard is lined with the big handmade jars and using the abundant sunshine in southern Taiwan and by daily to create a rich classic flavor. So I can see on the board, this chili um, sauce can be used for Mapo tofu and also um, beef noodle soup, right? Yeah. I think this is like, for me, I, I, I'm a big fan of mapo tofu as well as um, beef noodle soup. So definitely you will need this one and it tastes so good. And I can smell something. So Elsa, would you like me, uh, would you like to show me? Yeah, please. <laughs> Smells really good. Please follow me. Too bad our audience cannot enjoy this, but I'm here. I can smell the beautiful scent. Oh, look at this. It's the mapo tofu. Wow, and we use it's bubbly. These two of it. So tell us a bit about what, what, why, why would you choose these two chili sauces rather than the ones that we saw over uh, this there? This one is more spicy and it's more close to the local mainland China. It's oh. a little bit like a Sichuan flavor. Sichuan flavor, yeah. like really spicy and really even spicy. a bit numbing, right? Yeah. And we ate a little bit this one. It's different from the classic one because we put a little bit longer and let the, let the sauce more deeper. Oh my gosh, it smells really, really good. So can we, are you, are you going to, oh, okay. Put a starch inside. All right. So tell us a bit more about what's the main market for Mingdo Foods. Uh, main market right now is still in Taiwan. In Taiwan. Yeah, okay. but we are uh, look forward to haul the country in the overworld right Definitely, now. Definitely, like if the vendors online around the world, if you're interested in this high quality product, whether it's the chili bean paste or the oil tofu or all kinds of spices, definitely feel free to contact Ming the Foods. <laughs> all right, it smells really good. So finally, you're going to put the scallions, right? Oh, it smells really good. Too bad the audience, I feel sorry for you because they feel free for me. I will taste it for you on your behalf. All right. It's done. Oh, it's done. All right, perfect. 
So I think this is one of the most popular dishes, like when it comes to Chinese food, right? So if you need to cook the typical Chinese food, you will not do without the chili paste. And Mingde, this has been a household name. So definitely for people in Taiwan, we are very familiar with your products and taste really good. And the quality is very consistent, not to mention you have the green, uh, the, the clean label and also all kinds of certifications, right? We also meet the US standard. US standard, so perfect. And yeah, they're looking for buyers and also potential customers around the world. So if you're interested, feel free to contact Mingde Foods. <laughs> All right. Thank you very much. Do we still have time? Thank you so much, Elsa, for having us. I'll come back for the Mapo Dove okay. later. Thank you so Thank much. You. All right. Please follow me. Let's move on to the second stand. And now we're going to, you can see we have different kind of stands over here. And here we are at the second one. Please follow me. <laughs> Hello. Hello. Can yes. we have a microphone, please? Thank you. Brian, oh, yes. thanks for Brian. having us. Thank this you. is Wan Chong Food Wan Chong Soy Sauce. Right. Uh, we're, I'm Brian, and uh, we, our factory, Soy Soy Factory, start from uh, 1909, mm -hmm. uh, over a, a hundred years. Wow, long so history. We are the longest history Soy Soy manufacturer in Taiwan. Yes. And uh, here we are pre uh, presenting some of our products here. Yes. Tell us about the competitive edge of Wan Zhang. A lot of companies are making soy sauce, but what makes your company's soy sauce and products so special? Yeah, uh, because we have uh, the first one, we have the longest the history yes. one here. And second, and secondly, uh, uh, our signature product, product is the, the black bean soy sauce. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. The black bean soy sauce uh, is by handmade, by black, like this high, the big pot. Mm -hmm. Uh, fermented for Fermentation. for half a year. Oh wow! Half a year. So uh, here we are going to introduce you a little bit of please, some of, of our product. Please. Here, okay, this is very interesting. This is our new product. It's a uh, lard lard rice. Uh, it contains uh, there are three small package in inside, wow. uh, including the soy sauce, the the the, the special sauce, and the uh, fried onion, fried green onion, and also the lard. So uh, you mix with the three ingredients that give you a very delicious that rice. Make people remind remind people of the like old and traditional taste made the by old grandma. Old time, right? yes, yes, your grandma, grandma, taste, my, my grandma, grandma time, time. Yes. and also uh, this is uh, some of our pickles, the fermented tofu, spicy one, non spicy one. Right. It's Sweet all rice. all non GMO products. It's very good. Yes, Anything and else? also I want to introduce. Uh, this is our the vegetarian oyster sauce. Mm. The uh, the fits for all the kind of food and dishes. So even like simple uh, vegetables. Yes. You just put some oil, uh, a vegetarian oyster sauce on top of it. It will taste very good. Yes, that's right. Excellent. And uh, okay, here we are coming to um, our very uh, this popular is the most popular product the very popular you can see from the packaging exactly. right this is a family name right Everything yeah Taiwan yeah it says the Wan Chuang, and this yes. is our family name here yes. Chuang. we Chuang. are we are Chuang, Chuang Chuang's family, family. Yes. yes yes and uh this product is not so expensive and that's why we could uh, sell it very easily this in the supermarket daily, daily. Right? every family if right. they want to cook definitely they will need the yeah i think you will like it and really it, this so is the sweetness flavor. Ah, okay. So if more, it's more fit with the Taiwanese flavor so yes. as well. And here I want to introduce uh, because of the modern, uh, healthier um, like concept. People, more health people conscious, want right? to have that low sodium product. Low sodium, so low it's sodium for the yes. health. So this is like 25% um, so, uh, oh. sodium Less off. Less sodium, Less right? sodium. Perfect. So this is one of our uh, new so you can enjoy the taste but also stay healthy and popular ones Good. okay here i want to introduce the signature signature product the black bean soy sauce black bean soy yeah sauce. the black bean soy sauce soybean, it's black bean it's black bean okay uh probably some people you might know uh the uh soy sauce the the common soy sauce is made by soybean and wheat mm -hmm. but this one th this one is made by the uh the black bean and the black bean we have country farming uh, made it in Taiwan, mm -hmm. produced in Taiwan. So it's um, not just the soy sauce, but the materials mm -hmm. all made in Taiwan here. 
And Excellent. I strongly recommend this one. This is the star product. I love it. Love it. <laughs> Very good. Yeah. Uh, we have the, some of the special product like uh, special flavor, mm -hmm. uh, seaweed, and mushroom. Like, like kind of like Japanese. Sauce. Kind of Japanese. Like yes. umami taste. Umami right? taste. And you can use this for a soup, mm. for very like uh, vegetables. And I, I like it as, as, as well. I know you like all of them <laughs> because everything is so good. And I think I want to last day on introduce. Yes. This is made from the black bean mm -hmm. and soybean. Okay. Black bean and the whole soy bean. Excellent. Very rich flavor. Yeah, yes, right. very, very rich right. flavor. So thank you Try so it. much for introducing all these products. So my final question is, uh, where is the current market for your company? Uh, of course, we are based in here. Uh, we sell a product here in Taiwan mm -hmm. and also we export, export. to the States, Canada, mm -hmm. um, in Asia. We sell to Singapore, uh, Malaysia, Hong Kong, and we have a new, new factory in China. Excellent. Excellent. Yes. So for those of you interested in these high quality products, soy sauce or all kinds of products, feel free to contact Wan Zhang. Yes, please. Thank you so Thank much. You. Thank you, Brian, for have having day. us. Have a good day. Thank you. All right. So this way, please follow me. Thank you so much. So I also want to tell you that you can see there are so many brands and so many vendors. In this exhibition, there are a total of 320 vendors setting up 570 booths. So you can see the size and the scale of this exhibition. And as we walk by, you can see different products. And here we are. Oh, uh, no, not there yet. <laughs> here we are at the third stop. So I'm going to take you to Wei Yi Food Stuff. Hello, hi, Sheila. Thanks for having us. All right, tell us a bit more about Wei Yi Food Stuff. Thank you. Hello, we are the Wei Yi Food Stuff. We are the fish and the egg rolls manufacturing in the Taiwan. Our factory in the south of Taiwan, and we have the most uh, subtle cake of right. So HSCCP, EU, or FSC. Yeah. So it means that your company attaches great importance to the clean process as well as to ensure the highest quality yeah. for the products, right? Yes. Perfect. Yeah. So tell us about your star products. You talk about the egg rolls and the floss. What what would you like to yeah. introduce to us today? We have the tuna floss egg rolls. This is very special. Usually yeah. people don't think of this combination, right? Tuna yeah. and then egg roll. Yes, in uh, in the market you see the egg roll maybe it's uh, with uh, chocolate mm -hmm. or, or a peanut nut. butter. Yeah, so it's a sweet. But we added the tuna floss, so I think it's a very different. It's, it's hard for me to hand. imagine the taste, so I think it's better for me to taste it, right? Yes. yes. So probably can I have a try? Have a try. Thank you. So this is the fish floss, as you can see, tuna and also egg yeah. roll. You can see the tuna floss tuna, inside right? the cookie. Yeah, the combination, right? So I apologize to the audience watching here. I'm going to taste it on your behalf. And while I'm tasting, would you like to introduce any other products? Yes. Uh, we also have the uh, other egg rolls. Mm. It's a pump, pump uh, egg rolls. It's a seaweed and added some pump. I think it's maybe the girls or the women like this. When you stay in home, you can eat it with a uh, black tea like or one, right? another That's green tea. Wow. <laughs> so it's really interesting. Seaweed on the outside and then egg roll yeah. and then plum inside. I just tasted the um, tuna one. It's really yeah. good. Oh my gosh, it's, it's really just good. Our company uh, product lead. Yes, yes. And tell us a bit more about the competitive edge. So in addition to having all these flaws, uh, you also have yes. all these We products, also right? have the fish flaws like a tuna floss and uh, the tuna floss we have the clean label it means no added any msg coloring or preservative the ingredient is all nature we also have the salmon floss mm. yes and the pork floss now we sell the pork floss in the costco australia so if anyone yeah. in australia so can buy it these are great products for example if you want to have the floss like if you want to have say sandwiches yes. or what else sushi or kanji so these are just great combination 
put it on top of it. It's ready to eat, and it's very easy, yes. and it's very nutritious, yes. right? It's very convenient in right. Taiwan. Yes. Yeah. So, like for parents, if children they don't like to eat fish, then definitely it's a good way for them to enjoy the fish floss. And you have the combination, marlin and pork and yes. tuna and also salmon and with like yes, yes even we have the small one. It's really if, good. Yeah. If you are a student or you live in outside. You can buy the small one. It's very convenient when you stay in home. So it's really convenient. Yeah. Yeah. And also, it tastes really good. I just tasted for you. So whether it's the egg roll, whether it's the tuna one or yes. the seaweed one, both of them taste really, really good. So tell us a bit more about the uh, market for your company. Where do you sell currently? Yes. Now we sell to the uh, uh, Canada, USA, and the uh, the China. And the UK, Malaysia, Singapore. Wow! Yeah. So definitely, you are looking for more yeah. buyers from around yes, the world, right? Yes, because we have the EU certificate, oh, so okay. we can sell to the more EU countries. And also with this high quality products for the buyers interested from around the world, feel free to contact Wei Yi Foodstuff. Yeah, welcome. <laughs> All right, thank you so much. Thank you. Thanks for having us. Thank you. All right, so let's move on to the next stop. As you can see, uh, we have the booths coming from all uh, around the world. Like right here, you can find the Japanese vendors. They're also so selling some soy sauce. And now we would like to enter the aquaculture area, so we can find a lot of frozen seafood. And this is also in collaboration with the Kaohsiung uh, Marine Bureau. Kaohsiung is a seaport, so we have a lot of high-quality seafood products. And now we're going to take you to one of the biggest uh, seafood vendors here. So please follow me. You can see there a big stone. It's called Hong Yu Food. So here we are. We're going to meet with. Hello, Jeff. Thanks for having us. All right, this is the microphone. Hi. Hi, Jeff. Thanks for having us. Could you tell us a bit more about your company, uh, Hong Yu Foods? Yes, we are, we are major in cuttlefish bowl and cuttlefish products like cuttlefish pancake and cuttlefish roll. Mm -hmm. yes, and we have the newest All right, company. so I think you're more than ready. Show us what are the star products. The star product is cuttlefish shrimp cutlet. Mm. And this one is the most popular. You said it's even available in Costco, in right? Costco, yes. One of the best sellers. Yes, the best sellers. Excellent. Yes. Anything else? Like and this is the shrimp roll. And shrimp roll is the like second, second mm -hmm. is number two. Number two in Costco. Yes. So Hong Yu Hang, um, you you have the origin of Penghu, right? Yes, yes. Your brand started in Penghu. Penghu is an outer island of Taiwan. Taiwan is the main island. Penghu is an outer island, but they have high quality cuttlefish yes. and shrimp, so that's why they have the combination. And we can also tell us about this dumpling. You said this is also a very popular product, right? This product is launched in October. And this is the most popular now in Costco. Oh, now in Costco, number one number star one. product yes. in Costco. Yes. So interesting combination, seafood and the shrimp. You cannot just find the diced shrimp, but it's like a big shrimp inside the big dumpling. Big shrimp and cuttlefish. Wow. And uh, scallops. Yes. And fish, uh, fly fish roll. Wow, oh, yeah. already I'm very hungry. Very luxury. Yes, excellent. Do you have anything that you can show us? Uh, yes. I know, like just talking, by talking, that's not good enough. We're going to show you the real stuff. Oh, here we are now. Let's have a look. Oh, let's have a look. This is the... This is cuttlefish and cuttlefish shrimp cutlet. Cuttlefish and shrimp cutlet. Yes. So you can find, they're not just not the paste. You can find big chunk of shrimps and cuttlefish and scallops inside. Yes. The white one is cuttlefish. Wow. And red is shrimp. Looks really good. So do you mind if I give it a try? Yeah, you can try. Can see this is really crunch like you can find the breadcrumbs on the outside so it's really crunchy so it's already like this so what what do you do the customer need to do they just need to put it in the oven or oven and you can use air fryer mm. and deep fry pan mm. fry That's it's right. okay really crunchy really really delicious mm. i love it i love cuttlefish i love shrimp very very good okay. so you're going to take me here right yes we're talking about the cuttlefish, so now we're going to show you the real stuff. This oh, is, wow. This one is the 
core of our company. So this is the real cuttlefish. And everything this, starts from here. <laughs> yes, yes. And this one is di directly sourced from Penghu mm. and Taiwan. Yes. And so high quality, and you use like. Not like other companies, they may use some flowers, but you use like 100%? Yes, 100%. And we, all of the cuttlefish, we use hand peeled. Hand peeled, yes. so like handmade and very clean and meets the health standards, right? Yes. All right, thank you very thank much. You. So maybe we can have a look, all these are the other products you have, right? The frozen, frozen cuttlefish, cuttlefish ball. balls and, and pork balls and yeah. So, well, for now, where where uh, where do the company sell to you, um, the market? What kind of market have you entered? Um, Costco mm -hmm. and Carrefour. Carrefour. Oh, Carrefour. Okay, these are distributions. What about the countries? The countries are uh, um, United States, oh, okay. Canada, mm -hmm. and Australia. All right. Also, Hong Kong and China. Mm -hmm. yes. But I think good um, seafood products definitely. If you're not allergic, people love seafood, then yeah. definitely feel free to contact Hong Yu Foods for further information. Thank you so thank much, you. Jeff, for having thank us. You. Thank you. All right, thank you. So let's move on to our final stop. Please follow me like this. Please follow me. Now I'm going to take you to the final stop. As you can see, I have just introduced to you, these are the seafood area. And this is in collaboration with the Kaohsiung city government so you can find a lot of fish products aquaculture also tuna right here so follow me so this is the seafood wonderland as mentioned before Kaohsiung here we are at the seaport so that's why we have high quality seafood products and not just that you can see the fishermen's association and now I'm going to take you to the final stop. And right there you can see we have the Latin American Pavilion and also the Kingdom of Eswatini. So this is also very international. So here we are at the final stop. We are at Care Goods Products. So Wendy, thanks for having us. Hello. Hello. Uh, so we are Care. And as our brand name, we care about the customer. We care about the environment. And uh, so we, we like to, we use a uh, chemical free method to raise our fish, and all of the fish are raised by ourselves because we only trust our quality. And like we also care about SDG problems, so we not only the fish, we also uh, we keep the fish under the solar panel, so mm -hmm. we can uh, have the electricity and the uh, set fish at the same time. Perfect. So um, I can see that Wendy, you're showing us some products. So let me hold the microphone for you so people can see the products better. Tell us what what is what is it? this? Looks very fancy. Yeah, this is a caramel uh, roll. So it's a ready to go food, and you can like eat whatever you want. Just peel off the package, and you can see on the we top off the gold leaf. You can find so, gold, even yeah. this real gold, gold yeah. leaves. And it's our ori uh, our unique flavor. You cannot eat it outside. So a mullet row, it's usually um, eaten during the Lunar New Year yeah. because people would like to uh, have something like nice and fancy. But this is usually people will have to go through a lot of efforts, like they will have to bake it, to grill it. But this is ready to eat. It's so it's very convenient, just like candy. Open up the packet, yeah. you can just eat it right away. Yeah. Not to mention you have golden leaf on top yeah, of it. And right? the Hermes orange. Yes, and Hermes orange. Beautiful package and good for um, gifts, right? Yeah. Any other products you would like to introduce to us? So here we have ah, the, another beautiful package. Yeah, this is the, the fish floss. So different from the traditional pork floss. Uh, this is made of 100% of uh, our mullet fish. Mullet fish is really special, like mullet fish floss. I've never heard of it. Yeah, so I, I know that some of the pork product cannot be exported right now. Right. And I think this is perfect for as a souvenir. Right, because yeah. fish products, they, they can be exported. Yeah, sure. And then also we didn't add too many seasoning, too many mm -hmm. like sour powder. Because we want our customer to have the pure flavor of the uh, of our food. So definitely, we want to take the original taste of the food. All right, I know you have something you want to show me, right? So maybe this way, you can take the microphone. Okay. Yes, please. So today, oh, I can smell something. Yeah. Oh, smells really good. What 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 are these? These are the milk fish sausage, 
and we have the also the fish egg inside it. Oh, wow. And this is made of the six percent of the milk fish. Uh, also are raised by ourselves. And Again, you can, I have never uh, heard of milk, milk fish, fish sausage. So you use milk fish yeah. to make sausage, not just pork, not just other kind of fish, yes. but milk fish. Yeah, and you can see the size is smaller, so I right. think it's perfect for family, for yes, kids to eat. For kids. All right. Yeah. So can I have a taste? Sure. Uh, here. All right. Let me taste it. Mm, you can see this is the. You said you can find the muller row inside, right? Yeah. Like not just the regular sausage. You can find the little balls. These are the muller row. Let me have a taste. Mmm, very good texture. It's really, really good. And here we are. We have a very interesting machine. Would you like to tell us what it is? Uh, so this is the a uh, non-fried uh, shrimp crackers, and we use the high pressure to to uh, make for uh, oh, all right. We can shrimp. see it's coming yeah. out. And the ingredients are made. Uh, made from our soup that rest by ourselves and we didn't add too many seasoning because mm. we want the customer to taste the, or, the natural flavor of our seafood I can see it's super super crispy right yeah yeah do you want to have a test can I have a taste uh, nice. Nice. thank you it's right from the machine so you can find these are the shrimp cakes very crispy so let me do the ASMR for you. Mmm. You can hear the crunch, right? Yeah. Mm. It tastes really good. And just like what Wendy said, not too many other ingredients, not too many seasoning. I can taste the original flavor of the shrimp. It's really good. So tell us finally, where do you sell? Uh, so now we are sell only in Taiwan, but also um, in Singapore. But we we wish can go uh, to more country in the future. For like, uh, I know that like Muli World is really popular in Japan. Yes. So for example, like Japan or some Islam country, they didn't eat. Uh, right. they, they don't, don't have eat, a lot of seafood. Yeah, yeah, and they don't eat pork. So I right. think it would be a perfect chance if we can uh, go go to uh, go move into the world. Excellent. So if you're interested for our buyers online, feel free to contact yeah. uh, our product right uh, here. Yes. So uh, care, care, care good. Care good. Thank you so much. Thanks for having Thank us. You. Thank you. So for our audience online, thank you so much for joining the live tour. We just show you five vendors, but actually there are a lot more interesting and wonderful products for you to explore. So if you're interested, feel free to contact Titra. Feel free to contact these vendors. We hope you enjoy the live show and see you next time. And we hope to see you in Taiwan. Thank you. Goodbye. Thank you. See you next time.